I had a great winter break, um, spent a lot of time with my family. Um, most of the time we're at home, home is the best place in the world anyways, and enjoying the time with my little daughter as well, um, and training of course, you know, I, even from the first day after the last season, the new season already starts for me, you know, so it's really uh, getting back into that and uh, bringing myself back up to speed for the new season. The winter period is where I really need to increase my fitness level because then during the season it's all about just holding it. Um, there's not enough time to keep on further increasing it. So it's a really uh, crucial time of the year in the winter and I need to use it as well as I can as a, and as efficiently as I can. Um, so I've been training a lot and mainly I do uh, endurance stuff. So I like to go swimming or cycling and then I'll do some weight training for the specific Formula One muscles like my neck um, and then some other stuff uh, for reaction training, so some ping, ping pong and things like that. It's such an exciting experience to get behind the wheel of the new car, to feel it for the first time. You know, I've seen so many pictures of it, I've heard so much about it, um, so many presentations about it, where you know, we spent hours on, on discussing every detail, and to actually drive it and feel it is incredible. And, and I really look forward to that. And, uh, Especially also knowing that it is such a great car, you know, in relative terms to all the competitors and to at the F1 world, you know, we know that it is going to be one of the best cars um, and that's special. I'm really glad that the German Grand Prix is back in the calendar in 2016 because a Formula One World Championship without a German Grand Prix, that doesn't feel right. You know, I mean, Germany is such a big racing uh, fanatic country um, that we need to race there and, and me being German I really enjoy racing there and I won it two years ago or three years ago not sure when um, so I look forward to going back there and trying to win it again and the new race in Baku is going to be exciting for everybody uh, it looks like a great track um, with a new track it's always a, a particular challenge because we don't really know what to expect so you need to adapt a lot more and all that um, and I'm, yeah, I heard great things about the country and the city, so I look forward to that. This year there are going to be 21 races, which is great, of course, for the fans, for us uh, driving, but there is a limit to everything, and I think more or less that is going to be the limit, especially thinking about the people in the team, you know, uh, all, all the mechanics, all of our mechanics who are working on the car. For them, it starts to really become... Uh, too much traveling, you know, and too much time away from home. So um, they're the ones who need to, uh, we need to be careful that it doesn't become too much for them. It definitely seems crazy that I'm going to be doing my 200th race uh, this year in Singapore. Because thinking about a race weekend, you know, it's such a, such a event and it seems quite long. And, and then that I, to think that I've done 200 of those is, Pretty insane, um, but no, it's been a great time, you know, and a great, uh, great voyage, and, uh, and I look forward to many more races, and maybe there'll be a small celebration in uh, Singapore. Yeah, it was a great end to the season last year. Um, of course, I'm always adapting and modifying my approach, you know, and I found a bit of a better way, and I'm going to try and continue some of those things for this year. But unfortunately, uh, the car has changed. Um, a lot of things have changed, you know, so it's, uh, it's not going to be easy to, to bring across any of the stuff that I was doing. But uh, let's see. I mean, uh, I'm, I'm uh, optimistic, that's for sure. The key to unlocking the final step uh, towards the world title is uh, I'm looking for it, for sure, all the time, fighting for it, and I will fight again this year. Um, Opposition is strong, you know, Lewis has been doing a great job and uh, we need to keep an eye on the Ferraris as well. But with the car that we have and the team that we have, for sure we'll be up there and uh, I'll have another shot at it. So just one word please, flabbergasting. <laughs>